uh, as my promise I will continue the video uh, control the EFP 8266 by using Blink applications um, this, uh, this is combined project control by web server Blink application as well as uh, zero communication so I open the screen I open the program for Blink applications Blinks opens. Here is the program that I write uh, for the projects. Okay, I will download program to hardware first. Uh, remember that this is Blink project, so you need to start the Blink, uh, Blink server. Blink. You go to Blink application and start Blink local server. In this project, I use a local server. Blink application running here. Uh, waiting for project download and I come back to big figures excuse me a uh, row downloading what does a uh, row link server print the course go to videos go to goods This is complete hardware diagrams. Uh, we are doing the number trees uh, using building application to control ESP and ESP controls equipment. Let's see the download status. Download completed. Open your serial monitor and check. Yes. Data EF prompts. Connect to Blink server. Already complete. So I opened web browsers. I sorry. And IP address, sorry, IP address uh, 2, 4. Let's see what IP address of your hardware is. IP number 2, IP 2.
trees. is PIP2 what problem with this okay uh, now you can log in this ESP system is equipment admin here's a web server you can operate equipment from web servers as I said before ok you can off on the systems at the same time And you o uh, open setting and check IP address of ESP. ESP here, IP address of this. So you can set up your bling from here. Yeah, you set up your broker authorization, data IDs, password, and port for bling hardware for hardware and after setting value and then click save to save data to EEP e ROM and if you don't know you can see they have and to find the instruction from here how to do it using downloads laptop login everything writing here Not MCU, this is XOP linked. And go to home page. On off. Okay. And you also can check configuration uh, Wi Fi directly from web, web, web page. And also see their web, uh, the wire, well, the Access point save it here. Home base. Now I open my mm, my smartphones. Web server is still here. I remember that uh, the web server is if you don't set out to update. So when you use our uh, start stuff on another on a smartphone, the indicator is here is not up auto updates. So you need to set auto update for these values and start auto update. Uh, let me see. Off and I open Blink applications. I in the Blink application I have many projects. Uh, some project I done before. Uh, this simple projects and um, only digital output on strenuous application and you start on off for for light but here not update you need to refresh the page so the light is on off and refresh the page ah uh, okay on refresh the page if you don't like to refresh the page after starting and you can monitor equipment from the web server 
a web page you can need to on this enable this auto update screen value start enable auto updates so you can switch on from here and the light in the web uh, will auto update you don't need to refresh the page that okay off 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 on on okay the video for control equipment directly is by bling application from fast for smartphone bling application finished uh, thank you very much for your watchings i will come back to another videos for zero communications